Yo, if you ain't gonna rock them shades, the Gravity TV shades, pass them back. Shades, what shades? What? We need Gravity TV shades. Mm. Block them haters. Kahoy is a, um, Kahoy is like a Hawaiian brand. It's like a family owned business. And uh, they make like, their shades are made carved out of wood. And look, it says right there, authentic handmade. Kahoy's are handmade. And we should ask them if they'd make like a Gravit TV edition. And these would be like the official Gravit TV shades. Maybe get like a little engraving them. You know Yo, you know what I have at the house? I have wood, uh, wood burners. I have a wood burner. What's a wood burner? A wood burner is like a piece of metal that heats up and it, it melts. It burns oh, wood. Sorry. And I'll just put Gravit TV on the shade. Then this will be the actual original ones before yeah. the other ones. You can make a ramp with it. A ramp with my shades? We're talking about sunglasses, bruh. We're gonna get these made. Collaboration. Scratch card. That's crazy. Gravity V shades. It sounds fucking dope. See, Daddy O, your birthday, you, you inspire me, bro. You inspire me. We know I we have four kids, but I ain't gonna lie. I want one more boy. I want, did you know that when I was 16, I said I'm gonna have five kids? You swear did? to God. Swear to God. When I was 16, I said I want, I want five kids. And it's weird though, because I said I wanted two girls. I got three, but I just said I wanted two girls, and the rest boys. But I I need one more boy in my life. Like I need one more boy. But we got, we need to get at least one, more one million subscribers before I do this. <laughs> Why would you do this? Hey, if Gravit TV gets to a million subscribers, I'll have another baby. Oh, you said it. You said it. That's my word. All right, so if we're about, if we're at about 2,000 subscribers right now, which is incredible, right? So past that goal, obviously the next goal is 5K. But, um, mm, and we have like 42 videos, 43 videos up. Imagine when we hit like a million subscribers, how many videos we get lost in the freaking archives, bro. Imagine how good we're gonna be by then. That's gonna be crazy. Man, we need to, we, I wanna start doing concept videos too, like funny things. Like really funny things. Is I just want to do so much, but I feel like we the amount the kind of content that we're producing right now is like I feel like it's so it's so good for me personally. I feel like it's such good content that like we don't have enough people to show it to, and I just want to show it to the freaking world. I want to share the, with the world everything we're doing. Yeah, it has to be perfect timing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, like. My kids, they're crazy. I don't know, I think we just had the perfect gimmick, you know, like the perfect thing. Not the perfect family, right? We go through things that every family goes through, like, you know, hardships and financial struggles and uh, relationship problems, you know, but one thing I can say is that me and Bianca have learned to grow with each other, overcome, we fought, we've separated, we've brought it back, we've sat down and said these things are important. Like us being together is important. We, we know we love each other, we just, we're young parents. And we have now four kids and you know, we're just trying to figure this life out. Life is not easy, man, but days like today make things worth it. Like my son's birthday remind me of the day we had him. I want to tell you about the day we conceived him, you know what I'm saying? But the day we had him, it was epic. So epic. Grab a TV shades, block them haters. I'm gonna make them as soon as we get to the house. You're gonna make Gravity TV shades on your birthday, G? What are those? You don't even care, dude. 
Oh what? my god, you don't even care. It's your day though. So whatever you want to do is your day. You say it and I do it. it so I think I told you to get me a toy, would you do it? I don't know. Yeah, of course. I already got you some stuff, man. You got stuff waiting at the house for you right now. You just don't know what it is. It, um, don't even guess, bro. Because <laughs> I don't get it. I'll make you a deal. If you can guess what one thing is right now, <laughs> I'll give it to you. But if you guess wrong, you get nothing. Oh, that's a risky one. That's a risky one. Is it worth the guess? Is it worth the guess? No. It's not worth it, good man. All right, we're here. Cut the camera. Big day. All right, y'all. So, why you hear such great music in the background right now is because I'm working on this rain edit for y'all and uh setting the tone frank sinatra is just a man but what's really cool is that it's about time to create these kahoy glasses and we're gonna make them gravity v glasses official Gravity TV glasses. So basically, the reason why is I'm going to reach out. I already talked to these guys. They're awesome guys. And I would like for them to make the first ever official Gravity TV hater shades. Feel me? I wear these in all my vlogs. I just like the way it makes me feel when I rock them. Uh, but let's get started, shall we? Let's wing it. Look at me go. Turning at nothing to something, now they all love it Look at me go Ay, can't even go out in public, nobody trusted Look at me go Ay, pressure been building, I gotta raise up the ceiling First ever Can you see, how do we get that to work? Gravity V Hater Shades On deck I just wanna add some more value to everything I'm doing, you feel me? Like, it's how we got to do this, baby other than that, hey, you guys want to hear my goals? Like, you want to hear, you want to hear my brainstorm? Like, how I get my mind together? Yeah. I write. I don't, I don't know why I'm sharing this. I just feel like I should share this. But uh, one thing I ask myself, um, I ask myself this, these kind of questions on a regular basis. I have mad notebooks. I just have ideas on top of questions, and I answer my own questions. Um, one is. Facebook. Anyway, one is where we started. Where did my where have my vlogs started? Like how did they start? Where where it started and what was I doing? Well, I was testing the waters, becoming comfortable with vlogging. Where are we now? Now I'm focus my focus is now consistency. That's, that's the hard one. Um where is my vlog heading as far as content? That's a very big deal because it would allow me this will allow me to really focus but it's still a very wide range um my content um is heading as far as you know where, where my vlog is heading as far as content um it's more lifestyle family and fun breaking all in one so between my regular daily lifestyle along with my family and all the fun things that i like to do as a person on a regular basis plus breaking all in one it's hard to put it all together, but I gotta find the consistency uh, 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 um, within all that. What is my next goal? As far as this all has to do with like my brand, as Gravity TV as a brand, Catch Wreck as a brand, um, my vlog and breaking. Right. My next goal is 10k subscribers, a warehouse for vlogging and training in Arizona. The reason why is because. Arizona just allows you to have so much space and I want to tell you guys what I want to do with this warehouse, but ooh, I don't But it's a lot easier to get a warehouse for me. I've already had one um, 
And this is something that I really want to do. And I say that I really want to do this because, you know, I came to New York to train and like start teaching and uh, kill the game. But I've realized that I truly am in love with vlogging and creating content and what it's done for me as a person solely has just like really brought me out of a shell that I didn't even know I was in. I can talk to anybody. I can do whatever I want now. Like as a person, I'm not I'm free to speak my mind and try things. And it's just like, anyway. So because of that, I want to continue vlogging. And I just know like I am YouTube's next illest creator. I could say that because I look back at my content from like day one and then I look at what I have produced now and just how much better I'm getting and what I'm producing you can't find anywhere else. Nobody does it like me and that's what I love. So I found, I remember watching this video, um, this guy Casey Neistat, he put up and he was like, you know, in order for you to really become, you know, a great YouTuber, you have to do something or put stuff out there that nobody else is. And there's no other uh, b-boy with my lifestyle. And there's no other b-boy that is at my caliber uh, at breaking, in breaking, as far as uh, recognition goes, with four kids trying to create a business and share the lifestyle of the process. For those of you that don't know what the process is, it's starting from the ground and working your way up. I legitimately enjoy the process. I hate the freaking brick walls that I hit, but I enjoy the process. So there's nobody else out there doing this. And that is, that's what I love. I love that I am putting myself out there. I'm vulnerable and I don't mind it. And uh, plus I'm still living my dream and I'm sharing all my thoughts and I'm, I'm involved in everybody. I just love this. I love what my vlogs are allowing me to do with everybody within the community, people I meet, people I would have never met unless I started vlogging. Um, anyway, back to it. Um, how do we make money to support the family and the vlog dream? That's a big one. Because I'm going to tell you right now, vlogging ain't making me money. I just legitimately enjoy doing it. So how can I make more money to support the vlog? The vlog's gonna get expensive. If when you guys see what I'm doing, the vlog's gonna get very expensive, but it's gonna be so dope. Um, just because I just wanna, you, might, you know, my overall end game is to leave a legacy for my family, but I wanna show my kids that you can, you can make money by having fun and living your life to the fullest. When I die, I'm going to die with a smile, y'all. I promise you that. When I die, I'm going to die with a smile. Um, my answer to that was uh, becoming a brand ambassador for multiple brands. Um, and then gaining multiple corporate sponsors. I have one right now. And to gain multiple corporate sponsors, see, nowadays, it's, very, it's, it's a lot easier to do that than it was a few years ago. Um, between social media and the internet, I think it's a lot easier Um to gain sponsors or to become a brand ambassador, but baby steps, gotta figure these things out. Honestly, I have no idea. Monster came to me uh, through Moy, and I have no idea how he approached it with Monster. I mean, we've talked, but I don't know these things. So I, this, is a, this is a new journey that I wanna learn, you know, um, to find and to receive more sponsors and to become a brand ambassador so that I can produce more content where it's not hurting my family. I don't have to get a day job. I don't want a day job, y'all, at all, at all. So with that being said, these are the couple of questions that I ask myself. I ask myself questions on a regular basis. Today, I just decided to share these things with you after making Gravity TV's first official hater shades. Holla.